Hey, what's up guys? It's Jonathan, and you know, when it comes to protection and security, I definitely think it's a must. Whether it's a security system to protect you against burglars and break-ins, or smart health tech to prevent you from catching an illness or protect you from getting sick. But what about cybersecurity? What we use day in and day out of our lives? What we're on the most, whether it's a tablet, a computer, a cell phone, a wearable, our security systems at the house, anything that requires an internet connection, what's protecting that? Well, that's where the Bitdefender box comes in. My name is Jonathan, and I'm gonna tell you all about it. So I guess before I can tell you any more about the Bitdefender box, I need to show you the box that it comes in and what you get inside. And I just so happen to have one right here, so let's go check it out. The Bitdefender box second generation retails for 249 bucks and not only acts as a security hub for all of your IoT devices, but also you can use it as a standalone router since it has dual band wireless 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz AC1900 antennas on board. You can find links to purchase one for yourself down below in the description. The Bitdefender box comes well packaged as you can see, but it's what's on the inside that counts. The first thing you're greeted with is some paperwork on how to set up everything. And then you're gonna find the Bitdefender box itself, which is honestly much smaller than I expected. Next up is a little bit more paperwork, the AC adapter, and then lastly, an ethernet cable to connect your Bitdefender box to your existing modem or router. It features a perforated design with ventilation at the top to keep the 1.2 gigahertz dual core Cortex A9 and one gigabyte of DDR3 RAM, nice and cool. There's also four gigabytes of internal storage, which is mostly gonna be used for firmware storage, whether it's backups or restores and keeping the software up to date. On the backside, you have two one gigabit ethernet ports, a DC port and a small reset button. The setup process is extremely easy. Start by downloading the Bitdefender Central app on your iOS or Android device. It will prompt you to create an account and once that is complete, it's gonna walk you through the setup process, which takes about 10 minutes. First, plug in the Bitdefender box and go back to the app. Next up, connect the Bitdefender box to your modem. Once you have that hooked up, you're gonna to need to decide whether you want to use the Bitdefender box as a standalone router, use your ISP provided router, or use your own router. In my case, I use my own router. If you're going to go this route, you're gonna to need to follow the instructions from your router manufacturer on putting it in access point mode. Once that's done, connect the Bitdefender box to your router using a separate ethernet cable. The app will finalize everything and immediately start scanning all the devices on your network. More so, you'll receive several mobile notifications if a device connects to your network or if there are possible threats. The Bitdefender box also alerted me if a device needed closer attention in which I went in and I was able to manage that device using the app. I personally think it's really cool just how much is going on behind the scenes with the Bitdefender box. In conjunction with the app, it gives me a peace of mind since I store a ton of stuff on my devices, ranging from family photos to credit card information and even my social security number. Plus, I have a range of smart devices that are protecting my home and the Bitdefender box protects those devices from any kind of breach. The Bitdefender box comes loaded with extras, including mobile security, which will scan all of your email accounts on your device for any possible security leaks. You also have access to unlimited total security, multi-device cybersecurity software, which comes with unlimited downloads and installs for up to one year. You can download it from the Bitdefender website and ensure all of your household is protected. If you have little ones in your home, you can use the parental advisory feature to manage daily internet time, set content filters by age categories, pause internet usage altogether, and gain access to Bitdefender's online predator protection. The icing on the cake for me was the VPN feature that comes with the Bitdefender box, which is now powered by Anchor Free. So the Bitdefender box is a physical and tangible antivirus platform or device that not only protects your computers, but anything in your household that requires an internet connection. This could be a wearable, a tablet, a cell phone, a computer, a streaming device, or your smart home tech. And it's gonna prevent any malicious attacks or someone hacking into your security system where you have cameras installed and gaining control. It's a big deal and something that I am definitely happy I have in my house. So if you do a lot of online work or you just have a lot of tech in your house and you wanna protect yourself, your personal assets, your family, your loved ones, anything that is using the internet connection in your house from any kind of cybersecurity threats, well, guess what? Getting a Bitdefender box second generation makes a ton of sense. I'm happy I have one in my house because it gives me that extra sense of security whenever I'm browsing the web or just using my internet connected devices. 
So I definitely recommend it. Make sure you check them out. That link can be found in the description of this video. If you enjoyed this video, drop that thumbs up. Subscribe for more content. If you already are subscribed, make sure you turn on those notifications so you can be alerted when that content drops. If you have any questions, hit me up on social or leave me a comment down below and I'll talk to you in the next one.